hello today we are going to talk about IMAD if you are new here I am Sami um, currently preparing for IMAD uh, uh, which is going to held in uh, September uh, but there is no news yet but surely it will be in September so I am not going to talk about general um, structure and format of IMAD grading or scoring uh, but you can surely if you want to check uh, read or check out that stuff uh, link will be in video description uh, you should, should surely check out that but in this particular video we are going to discuss which books and uh, uh, the resources you should follow and how you should study for your IMAT so uh, this video is completely based on my own research and uh, facts and uh, truths that I have gathered from uh, different articles and different videos on YouTube so I want to explain in this uh, video mm, I haven't given I met yet I have already explained so you should not be in any uh, the confusion okay when it comes to books which from which books you should study uh, the first of all which I should recommend uh, you to study is uh, follow your own uh, books that you have studied in 11th and 12th for chemistry and physics and in biology if you have gained mastery on them then it will be easy for you to study uh, European books like uh, A level or Pearson two books are recommended if you want to study uh, and lot of uh, stuff that covers um, I met are A level or Pearson you can check out only one but first of all you should be studying from your own previous books because if your concepts are clear then uh, there is no uh, difficulty for, for you to be uh, studying from A level or Pearson so for chemistry physics and biology uh, you should check out uh, you should study from Pearson or A level uh, for critical thinking there is Cambridge book about critical thinking that will be somewhere here you can uh, look at that and uh, find on internet PDFs are all uh, everywhere PDFs are in tons on internet so don't worry about that everything will be fine uh, just look at three books uh, about chemistry biology and physics from a level or Pearson and uh, crit about critical thinking from Cambridge uh, that I don't know uh, model or year uh, that will be displaying here okay but uh, when it comes to general knowledge there is no as such book or uh, material that is uh, covering general knowledge for um, uh, IMAT but what you can do is just uh, forget that stuff uh, for in beginning just focus on chemistry and biology or critical thinking so general knowledge is like it is general uh, it is not some specific knowledge it will be easy so if you have knowledge about history of world like um, uh, union uh, countries and different countries that are uh, the part of United Nation it are general MCQ so uh, you what you can do is you should check out uh, a previous exam from where you can get experience and then uh, you should uh, study uh, by that stuff but uh, don't worry about don't be uh, wander uh, for finding general book there are no as such specific books now let's move to um, uh, our how to study for IMAD in my that is my personal method or a best method you can ever find on internet uh, that I uh, that by which I study is uh, Pomodoro technique using Pomodoro technique if you are don't uh, you are already familiar with it but if you don't know uh, what is Pomodoro it is a simple time blocking technique in which you allocate time of 30 minutes uh, for one cycle and you study for 30 or 25 minutes with sharp focus uh, no any other work no mobile phone or no any other thing just study mm, choose one topic and then study uh, that 
topic in that 25 minute so after 25 minute uh, you can use timer for that after 25 minute uh, take break for 5 minutes and then other cycle will begin that will be counting for second cycle and it will be same but after that the break will be extend mm, like you can take break of 15 minutes and in that time you surely play or do any valuable stuff like uh, that uh, makes you re relax mm, don't be scroll instagram or facebook or social media like me uh, it is completely waste of time okay this is the last part of video uh, which is uh, bonus part uh, it is completely uh about practice like practice lot of mcqs from previous imat exams uh, there are a lot of websites on which um, uh, previous exam papers are present uh, you should surely check out that uh, so just look at them and solve them or take some idea from them and it will really help it is helping me more than any other thing like books are just crap uh the thing that uh, makes me more uh, good at studying is practicing previous exam paper uh, the recommended time period is you should solve or um, study um, previous one exam paper after two weeks but if you are not following this um, time period then you sh at least uh, after one month you should look at Mm, previous exam paper because this is the only way uh, how you should uh, be uh, evaluating your uh, preparation uh, so this is the only way how you can find your difficulties or how you how you are prepared for this so uh, thank you for watching this is just uh, that's for all today mm, if uh, you haven't subscribed this channel yet surely uh, subscribe it for more imat related content and for more useful content uh, that's for that's it uh, tata bye bye for now